Authorities in Bulgaria are now looking into the possibility of an accomplice in Wednesday's suicide bus bombing that killed five Israeli tourists. Here's WKRN. As of this morning, officials believe a second suspect may have been involved in the bombing. Investigators believe the bomb was detonated by the man seen in the security video, but are unsure as to whether or not that was the same man who boarded the bus. According to Z News, onlookers in Burgas said the bomber fit a very different description. Several eyewitnesses have told investigators that the bomber had short hair and he spoke English with a distinct accent. However, the man on the security video has long hair. Sources say a previously unknown group of terrorists stepped forward Saturday claiming responsibility and promising more attacks. But officials in Israel, the United States and Bulgaria said Wednesday's attack bears some resemblance to previous attacks by Hezbollah. Here's CBS News. They believe a Hezbollah cell operating in Bulgaria was behind the bus attack and they believe they have developed the intelligence information to back that up. But why was Bulgaria singled out for this attack? One CNN writer explains why he thinks Bulgaria was a prime target. Since Bulgaria sent troops to both Iraq and Afghanistan to demonstrate solidarity with the United States' war on terror after September 11, 2001, Bulgarian security authorities have recognized that the country could become a target for terrorism. In addition to the fatalities, the bombing wounded more than 30 Israeli tourists. For Newsy, I'm Christian Bryant. Multiple sources, The Real Story.